What up, everybody? Cardboard, uh, what's my name again? Moses? I'll be forgetting. Uncle Jesse, you all know and love me. And, uh, I, I sound a little arrogant, but I know I know th I know this to be true. How are you all doing? It's time to uh, start things off here with a little prison football 2017 action. We're gonna do a half case. That's six boxes. Break number seven. eBay style, straight from the farm. Let's go. Let's do it. What it do, Solomon? How are you? I was uh, funny enough. Last night, I was hanging out with my boy, and uh, like me, we don't really watch TV, so we're just like randomly talking shit about, uh, we're talking about the football game Sunday, right? And then he's like, yo, what's up with that Dilly Dilly commercial? He had never seen the Dilly Dilly commercials, and I went ahead and I just hit him in over the face with like the super mashup of like all the Dilly Dilly commercials. And it's pretty funny. I just, I like the fact that they kind of like, um, it's like a bit, a bit of a satire on Game of Thrones, which I can't, I can't wait for that to come out. What it do, Solomon? What up, Andrew? Uh, you guys should know the deal by now. If you've breaking, uh, if you've broken here before, make, make those requests. What, what team you got? Who you looking for? Do that now. Because uh, if you wait to the last box, that's not good mojo, people. That, that is not good mojo. So uh, speak now or uh, forever hold your peace kind of deal. All right. All right. With that being said, let's go ahead and rip this thing open. Let's see what we got up in here. Before I even continue, good luck, everybody. What up, DeGrom? Andrew got the Jags. Oh, boy. Looking for the Fournette. You know, that was a good game. That was a good game. But damn it, man. Jags. What a way to choke. Solomon got the Lions. Raiders. Lions. Let's get it. What up, JD? You want some Cowboys? You gonna get you some Cowboys. Just like that. My man Andrew looking for some Zay Jones, Bill, Colts and the Dolphins. What's up, B Stalls? You you had me at Dolphins. They are my favorite team against all odds. What's up, Aaron? How are you? See what kind of hotness is hiding in these prism. So how was everyone's weekend? I mean, technically it's Tuesday, but it feels like a Monday to me. How's everybody feeling? Let's uh, let's see if we can make you feel a little bit better. Now we got this prism underway. Here we go. Good luck, y'all. Starting us off for the Titans, we have Adore Jackson with the Cracked Ice Auto. That is a nice looking card. I got top loaders. I'm going to go ahead and top load this thing. That's a nice card. So it's top loaded. And I'm going to show it off a little bit. Show it off a little bit. It's a nice card. What else we got? Hey, the 18% off. Everybody wants that. What else we got? CJ Beathard of the Niners. Kind of feel for this kid. He, he might be under uh, Jimmy G's shadow for a little bit. But you never know. You never know. 
Hey, the kid reporter. We're going to random those at the end. No, no, we're not. Hey! Already hitting that hotness to 99. Leonard Fournette of the Jaguars. That is a nice card, dang it. And it looks sweet with the Jags colors, too. That is nice. That is nice. Go ahead and T load this thing. Prism starting off hot. Prism starting off hot, man. Oh, baby is right, Andrew. Got a little red prism for Jonathan Allen, Redskins. Yeah, that Fournette, definitely a nice card. Might be a sign of things to come here. Might be a sign of things to come. Maybe you see a biscuit or something. Who knows? Taco Charlton. With the, I think they call these the Blue Wave Refractors. Number to one for Nan. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to watch the Super Bowl this year. What'd it do, Tomas? We was just talking about you, Tomas. And by us, I mean me and uh, the cardboard Jesus. I don't know what I would do without you, Tomas, honestly. You are like, uh, you are the wind beneath my wings. Travis Benjamin of the Chargers. Blue Wave Deal. How's everybody doing? Marshawn Lynch of the Raiders, green. What else? What else? What else? Aaron, what, what did I do? What did I do? I, do? I don't know. I say and do things that I, I don't even think. I just, I just do. Which uh, has gotten me into some problems on occasion. I hope I hope I did something good. Early, yeah, this is correct. What can I listen, man? You know, you gotta let the cardboard powers uh, rejuvenate, and then I come back hitting straight dingers. LaShawn McCoy of the Bills. With the red prism. That prism looks a little funky. Really nice. Yo, Tomas. A uh, little birdie told me you wasn't getting into absolute basketball until you, until it actually got here. Guess what? It's here. So uh, go ahead and buy that up. Still got a lot of good teams left. There's Brian Orange for the boys. Should get at least one more autograph. Here it is. Demarcus Walker of the Broncos. What it do, Tom, uh, Pappy? Go ahead, Top Low Diaz. This is bothering me just a tad. And uh, what else we got here? That's it for the first box. And I gotta say, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Let's see if we can make it a, a little bit more good. Leave that Leonard Fournette up there by its lonesome. That's a nice card. Oh, listen, Pappy, please talk Patriots all night. That that's really why I'm here. I could not wait to come in and uh, and deal with the onslaught of the Patriots fans. I'm even ready to, to accept the Viking hate talk. Well, actually the Eagles. Because I had the Vikings and the Jaguars in the Super Bowl. And uh, neither of those teams won. So I am no longer picking anybody. What a Dukean. What a BJ. The Vikings are still zero for your lifetime in championships. Yeah, Kian, I... I was pulling for the Vikings. I really was. I mean, it, and it's no disrespect to the Eagles. It's just for the simple fact that I had seen the Eagles in the Super Bowl. 
And I haven't seen the Vikings in the Super Bowl in my lifetime anyway. So I thought, you know, I like to root for the underdog. But Eagles Patriots rematch from, I think it was, what was it, 05? It's a completely different Eagles team. More or less the same Patriots bullshit, you know. We're a system. Yeah, a system that uh, pays for the referees and, you know, give them hand jays in between quarters and whatnot. God, I hate the Patriots. I'm, I am, I am, I am definitely salty. Like that's not even a question. Andrew, you know what? I thought the same thing about the Jaguars' pass rush, man. I thought, man, they got, they got too, they got too many Pro Bowlers on that front line. DBs are gonna shut down their receivers. They're gonna jam them. They gonna have, he ain't gonna have no time to throw the ball because he's gonna have constant pressure for you know four quarters. None of it happened. Brady had all day to do whatever he wanted back there. Every now and then they put pressure, but it wasn't consistent enough. You gotta you gotta keep pressure on Brady for the entire game. If the Dolphins can do it, anybody can do it. That's all I gotta say about that. Oh, but Jesse, it was a regular season game. I don't care. We we won. So so technically, if if the Patriots win the Super Bowl, it's kinda like the Dolphins did too. Because, you know, having beat them and through the, 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 I don't know, whatever. The 250 Panini points, yay, how we love those. That will get randomed, of course. We got Mike Glennon of the Bears, orange. Uh, Tomas, that's about it, man. We have a Chronicles PYT in the store that we're awaiting to drop. But I want to I wanna look at the checklist first because that hasn't come out yet before I drop the, uh, the PYT tizzle. Might have to play with some prices depending, of course, on the checklist. You know how that goes. Keen's dead. You got the Bears in this thing or what? Zach Ertz of the Eagles. He's going to be big time. He needs to be big time against the Patriots. It might be a good Super Bowl. We'll see. We got Carson Palmer of the Cardinals. Red. Actually, we have uh, Immaculate Football in the store, y'all. Which is a uh, mucho fancy, mucho fancy. Uh, yeah, Kian, this is an eBay break. Yes, it is. Nope. So the biscuit is gonna be falling out the packs. You know, that's. I hate to say it, but that that is how funny the cardboard gods are funny that way. Oh, you're not in this break. Oh, okay. Let me go ahead and uh, hit everything you ever wanted. Alright, I already see an autograph just staring at me right there. But I'm going to wait to get to it. Marquise Lee of the Jags. Flaw I don't think we have flawless football in the store. We have immaculate football. I know that for sure. Now you got me second guessing what I'm doing. Yeah, we got immaculate football in the stizzo. Got a little green for the Ravens, Danny Woodhead. Yeah, Pappy, you had me tripping for a second. I was like, damn, I got flawless? I got things I don't even know we got. Didi Westbrook of the Jags with the autograph. Jaguars are uh, doing the thing right now. Closing in on 300 biscuits. Dan Keen's dead. You might as well open up a... Uh, See, I can't finish the joke because the timing is gone now. But I was going to say, you should open up like a bakery or something, bro. <laughs> what else we got? 
for the Bears, Adam Shaheen, the auto. He's a good player, too, Adam Shaheen. Bears, Bears got a nice little uh, future coming up. Really depends on how the bisque is going to develop into his uh, sophomore year. We got Malachi Dupree, Packers Orange. What up, Cardboard Chasers? Uh, see, now now I know you want a McCaffrey. You should have asked for it earlier, man. It, it, could, it could happen still. It could happen still. But definitely Jags and Fuego. If you don't know what that means, uh, they lit. That's what the kids say anyway. So yeah, peeps, we do have Immaculate Football in the store, baby. So if you want in on that action, check out RipCityCards.com. Not to mention, if you've never purchased on a website, you can save 15 bucks. I want to save 15 bucks. Oh, I know you do. So all you got to do is go to RipCityCards.com. At the top right of the page, you're going to click Login. From there, click Register. Fill out all that information, and then we will automatically email you a code so you can save 15 bucks on your first purchase. So go ahead and do that. Aside from all the eBay stuff, I want to get rid of that absolute that's in the store. And I also want to get rid of the Immaculate. Why not? And while we're at it, let's go ahead and fill up that flawless baseball. I hear you, Andrew. But listen, man, don't give up. Don't give up, especially if that's the team you want, man. I, I, I was talking about it earlier. I have seen it happen way too many times where someone who always gets the same team doesn't get it in a break, and in that break, they hit a bunch. The cardboard gods are funny that way. But you got to keep the faith. Alright, we're halfway there. Let's see what we got here. Got Mark Ingram of the Saints. Green. Prism is such a nice product. Got a Deshaun Whit well, Whitson. Deshaun Watson Illumination insert. That's a nice looking card. John Ross the third of the Bengals. Blue Wave. Let me go ahead and sleeve up the Watson too. The Illumination insert. Probably goes for some change. There's that. How about the Eagles, though? Did anybody see that coming? I, I thought that game was going to be a lot closer than it really was, man. Vikings just put their taints all over the Vikings. That was, that was, that was hard to watch. What do we have here? For the Bengals, Jordan Willis, the autograph. All right, spreading some love here. Bengals with a hit. What else? We got Keenan Allen on the Chargers orange. Pretty nice. What else we got? Jonathan Stewart of the Panthers. Light blue. That looks nice with the Panther colors. That's number two, 199. One out of 199 to be exact. That's pretty cool. Nothing there. Nothing there. What do we have here? Man, for the Bears, Adam Shaheen. 
back at it again. Would have been nice if they threw a biscuit in there for shits and gigs. Why not? All right. We got Corey Davis of the Titans to one eighty nine. Dual Shaheen action. See if we can throw a biscuit in between that. For the Cowboys, this is a good one. Ryan Switzer with the autograph. That's a nice card. Solid rookie campaign. There you go. What else we got? I think we should get at least one more autograph out of here. What's it gonna be? About Blake Bortles. You had a chance, big guy, but you fell short. What else? What else? Tyler Eifert of the Bengals. You know, maybe if sassy Jalen Ramsey never said anything, we going to the Super Bowl. We going to win that bit, bruh. You got to get there first. Writing checks that your ass can't cash, man. Matt Ryan of the Falcons with the blue weave. You are welcome, JD, for whatever I did. I think uh, you had the Cowboys, JD. Scoop this over. All right. We're halfway through. Let's keep it going. Whoa. That's what we like to call a hit quake. Box is so fire, it's just knocking things over. So now he's sassy, classy Jalen Ramsey. I like it. I'm surprised he hasn't come out and like said anything about the referees. Probably because he didn't want to take that that pay cut. You know, yo, you know what I found out today? Uh, what early I was watching videos and shit, and you know who who's really coming out on top about the uh, the Patriots getting to the Super Bowl? Believe it or not, Jimmy G. Jimmy G had an incentive in his contract where you know technically he started the season off with the Patriots, and he has an incentive in his contract where. If they make it to the AFC Championship, you know, he gets a certain amount of money. I think like 80K or something like that. Uh, and for actually making it to the Super Bowl, he gets more money. If they win the Super Bowl, he gets even more money, like 125K or something like that. So Jimmy G, not even playing for the Patriots, and I bet you he's rooting for him. Get a little, uh, get a little extra moolah. What up, uh, Radical Bob? Let's let's see him, Andrew. Hopefully, you've been a good boy. If you've been a good boy, cardboard gods are gonna please you. Same with you, B. B stalls. If you guys have all been good and been paying your tithes to the cardboard gods. You should see a hit coming up soon. So, uh, good luck to you. 163k for winning the Super Bowl. And he don't even play for them no more. That's baller. Jimmy G laughing all the way to the bank. What do we got here? We got, for the Raiders... Gary and Conley. The Raider autograph. There you go, Raiders getting a hit.
I wonder what the Raiders are going to look like next year with uh, old Chucky Boy as their coach again. Jonu Smith, Titans Orange. I think I see a, a Panther hit possibly coming up here. And I called it. Somebody asked for a McCaffrey. You got a McCaffrey. Christian McCaffrey. Oh, the Panthers autograph. That is nice. It's not autograph. It's not numbered, I should say. But it is definitely nice. Uh, Ziggy Bowles, I didn't work yesterday, so the answer is no. I was off Sunday and Monday, so I have no idea what you're talking about, Willis. But I'll check that here after I'm done with this. You got a cardboard chasers? You see what I'm saying? Ask, and you shall receive. Willie Sneed of the Saints Orange. Am I am I in trouble, Ziggy? Am I in trouble? Mike Williams of the Chargers, green action. That's a nice looking card. He's going to kill it next year. Watch. Calling it. All right. Let's spread the love here. Got some peeps that haven't got a hit yet. Keenan Allen, Chargers. To 199. Okay, I got you. Yeah, uh, speaking of that, I don't even know what the what the price that at yet, uh, Ziggy, because the checklist hasn't come out yet. So I do have a PYT for it. Jason was uh, kind enough to to get that going, but he hit, we didn't post it yet because checklist isn't out, and that would be a foolish move to put a PYT up. When we don't even know what's in it, more or less, you know? Hopefully that'll be out later tonight, so I could just post it. Isaiah McKenzie Broncos, Blue Wave. What up, Rockets boy? Let's get that absolute out the way. It is, it is here. It is here. So I'm going to push it real good. Josh Malone of the Bengals. It looks like he went to, to autograph school, but he, 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 he didn't get too advanced into the autograph school. He learned how to do cursive, and that's it. He said, I, I got enough. That should be a real thing, autograph school. Take some of these kids to autograph school. Kyle Williams of the Bills, green. How's everything with you, Rockets boy? Yo, the Rockets spanked the Heat last night. But that's all right, though. That's all right, though. Y'all got like, y'all got like three superstars. We got none, and we kept it close. We kept it close. So I'm proud of my boys. Mind you, we're missing our superstar, who I guess technically would be Dion Waiters. Right, listen, man, I'm telling you, watch out for the Heat. Watch out for the heat. Duke Johnson of the Browns Red Prism. You know, we, we was we was hanging in there with arguably one of the best teams in the league. So watch out. He gonna make noise in the playoffs, I'm telling you right now. The nobody in the East wants to see the heat in the playoffs. We're gonna be a tough out. And what I wanna see, I wanna see Cleveland, Miami. In like the first round. That would be so sick. Especially if we knock him off. What? Eat shit LeBron. And you too D-Wade. That would be awesome. I mean I'll be honest. I really don't expect us to win a championship. With the team we got. But. We're definitely going to make noise in the playoffs. Well, I think we can knock off. The one, two, or three seed. In the east. And I think right now we're still in fourth place. So if we were to see the Cavaliers, it would likely be in the uh, in the semifinal. You know, if we take care of business, and I think we will. But we'll see, man. Playoffs should be interesting. Playoffs should be interesting.
Dude, we defend everything, Rockets boy. Like, that's what I love about the this Heat team. And most Heat teams, you know, we're, we're usually really scrappy. We go after every loose ball. We close out on everything. We play defense. White side down there controlling the paint. So you ain't going to go in there all willy-nilly. And the shooters, we close out on shooters, man. Put a hand in your face. We make it difficult. I, I love my Heat team. I really do. Bunch of scrappy guys. I still feel like Whiteside needs to add more to his game offensively. Once that happens, poof, problems. I'm telling you, man, the boys are scrappy. The Heat are scrappy. We outwork the other team every night. We have to because we're, we're not as talented as most teams on any given night. But we're definitely going to outwork you. And they finally revealed the uh, the Heat uniforms, the the Miami Vice uniforms. Oh my God, they are so nice, so nice. All right, let's see what we got here. Almost done with this. B stalls one time for the one time. Make that request. Put it out there. Put it out into the air. I got another box after this. Brian Arakbo, Titans, Blue Wave. And that's it. Carlos Hyde, Niners Orange. Got Derek Carr, Raiders. Light blue action. Nothing there. I know I saw a red autograph. Got 250 Panini points. Got a random that at the end. I usually combine Panini points, but I think I'm going to just keep them separate. Because those technically count as autographs. So I'll do it like that. Uh, yeah, we are going to get some of that tomorrow, uh, Rockets boy. Jamal Charles, Broncos, Purple, Cracked Ice. Uh, we just have to... What I'm doing, I'm waiting for the PYT to come out. So I can look at the checklist and then price the teams out accordingly. But we are going to get some of that Chronicles for show. Doug Martin, Bucks. Boom. Let's see what's in this stack. Deshaun Watson. Light blue. Card stick just a tad. What do we have here? Numbered six out of ten. John Ross the third of the Bengals. Bengals putting in work on this break. That's a gold patented penmanship autograph right there for the Bengals. That's a nice looking card. Gonna go ahead and uh, T load this thing. Very nice. There's still the red prism autograph that I seen. Waiting for that one to come out to play. Robert Davis orange for the Redskins. That's it there. And what do we have here? Got Malik Hooker of the Colts green. Uh, not yet, Rockets boy. Hence why it's not posted yet. Uh, I think Cardboard Connection has a uh, a checklist, 
it's not the easiest thing to uh, to go through, but they're usually the first with checklists. But I, I like going to group break checklists because they they make it very easy for me. They put it in a in an Excel sheet, do it by teams, autographs, relics, and I know the print run and all that. So it just makes my life a lot easier. Because I'm super lazy. All right, we should have the one autograph. There it is, number twenty-four to forty-nine, Corey Clement of the Eagles. Cobra Connection doesn't have it yet, dang. So I guess we're stuck playing the waiting game. But as soon as the checklist comes out, I'm gonna peruse that thing, and then I'm gonna post that thing, and then I'm gonna send the email out so everybody knows we got that thing. You know what I'm saying? All right, so, so far, nicest hit is the Fournette. Let's see if we can make some other peeps happy. What is that, Rockets boy? Yeah, I've seen some of the pictures for it, and uh, really, it's gorgeous. I'll be honest, with the, with the, with the exception of... Like the Chronicles actual set, like the, the Chronicles stuff, I'm not really a fan of. But there's some cool stuff. You know, there's, there's the gold standard stuff in there. Um, are they still doing Spectra in it? If it's anything like Chronicles Baseball, it should have seven different products in it. Right, this is last box moho raw if you haven't got a hit now is your time to make those requests to the cardboard guides let's see what we got Ah, so it doesn't have Spectra. See, it has some products I, products I haven't even heard of. I've seen Majestic. That stuff is nice. Gold Standard, nice. Gala, nice. Limited, eh, Limited is all right. Pinnacle, haven't seen that. Titanium, Marquee. Actually, I have seen some Marquee. That stuff's decent. Haven't seen Titanium. Haven't seen Brilliance. Momentum or Pinnacle. So it should be interesting. Alright guys, almost done with this. And now let's fill up the absolute basketball that we have on our website, you guys. Let's destroy that. Still got, uh, I think, 22 teams left on that. Let's get that out the way and be done with that. Keep in mind, it's a full case break, you guys. Not that not that half case eBay business. I'm talking full casers in the store, baby. I see more panini points. That is not cool. I mean, no likey panini points. All right. As always, good luck, everybody. All right, let's get the Panini points out the way here. 150 of them. We'll give that away at the end of the break. All right, you guys. See what we got. Good luck, everybody. David Johnson, Cardinals Orange. What else? Nothing there. Well, I already know one autograph because it's staring at me. Gronkowski illumination insert. Gerard Davis of the Lions orange. What else? Alright, the autograph that was been staring at me belongs to CJ Bethard. Of the Niners. Niners with a hit right there. 
I need some more top loaders. What do you think about the product, Rockets Boy? The Chronicles basketball. Based off the pictures, do you like it? What's 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 your uh what's your deal? What else we got? We should get two more autographs coming out of this box. Julio Jones, Falcons Orange. I, I, yeah, there we go, Rockets. Great minds think alike. For the Titans to 75, Jonu Smith. Chronicles is definitely weird. I, I agree. But a good weird. Not like a bad weird. Because this really nice stuff. There's really nice stuff in there. Like, the Chronicles set aside, the other products that are in it, are pretty decent you know everybody says I'm not a fan until you hit until you hit something and then it's like oh my god I love this stuff <laughs> Raekwon McMillan of the Dolphins light blue no one's a fan until you start hitting dingers then it's like oh my god this is the greatest stuff ever Randall Cobb, Packers, Blue Wave. What else? Golden Tate, the third of the Lions, Orange. Almost done with this. Should be getting at least one more autograph. Who is it going to be? We're going to find out momentarily. Tekken Jr. of the Saints Green. That's a cool looking card. There's that. And last stack mojo. Julius Thomas. Man, what a fail this year. Tista Boar Lions Blue Wave. What's up, JV? How you doing, man? Long time no see, bro. Hope all is well. Got a little light blue action for Jamal Charles of the Broncos. Yeah, I thought we had like another autograph incoming here. Well, I forgot we did get the Panini points. <sighs> Those sneaky Panini points. I forget they take the place of an autograph. And that was it for the break, you guys. We have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Yep. Got 18 hits, 18 autos, more or less. We do have Panini points, but those Panini points, we got a random. So let's go ahead and do that right now. Roll the die. See how many times we're going to do this thing. We're going to go nine times in the randoms, all right? Fairly simple. All I got to do is grab the teams. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, I believe we have the base set in this thing, too. So I'll go ahead and put that up. Slide this over. And uh, is it this one? Yep, there it is. Got, got to take a little vacation, JV. Take a little vacation, man. All right, so the first one is for 150 Panini points. We're going to go nine times. Good luck, you guys. Top team wins 150 Panini points. And the money shot nine going to the dolphins a little small small redemption for the dolphins 
who did not get an autograph. But you do get 150 Panini points. Alright. Now we're going to do 250 Panini points. Again, nine times. Good luck. This is for 250 Panini points. And the money shot. Go into the Panthers this time. 250 Panini points going to the Panthers. There it is. Now we got another 250 Panini points. So you guessed it. You gotta random those two. Nine times. Good luck. And the money shot. Nine. 250 Panini points going to the Giants. Giants, I believe, also did not get an autograph, so minor redemption for them. So, Giants getting 250 Panini points, Panthers getting 250, and the Dolphins getting 150. Those are the randoms. Now, it is time for the recap. So, we had John o. Smith Titans, Bethard Niners, Clement Eagles, Ross Bengals, Malone Bengals, McCaffrey Panthers, Conley Raiders, Switzer Cowboys, Shaheen Bears, Willis Bengals, Shaheen Bears, Westbrook Jags, Jackson Titans, Walker Broncos, and the nicest one to come out was Leonard Fournette of the Jaguars. And that was the break, you guys. 2017 Prison Football Half Case. I believe it was number 7. I think. I, I can't recall. Uh, let me double check that. I don't want to give you false information. But I'm pretty sure it was number 7. And indeed, it was number 7. 2017 Prison Football. Half case break number seven. Boom. In your face. eBay style. Thank you all very much. We'll get that out to you.